ampicillin is a medication that is used often in the hospital. And we're going to talk about what it is and how we use it. So the trade name is Principin, generic name ampicillin. It's action is it's bactericidal. So what does that mean, bactericidal? That really just means that it kills the bacteria, right? It's broader spectrum than penicillin and some other uh, cillins. And what it does is it binds to the cell wall leading to this bacterial cell death. So by binding to that cell wall, it actually kills the uh, bacteria. So the indications for use are skin infections, soft tis- tissue infections, respiratory infections, GU infections, meningitis, septicemia. So it has, like we said there, it has a very broad spectrum of uh, bacteria that it can actually kill. Also used often in otitis media and sinusitis. So these sinus infections it can be used for. Um, so if you have somebody come in, you're not really sure what's going on, not really sure what type of uh, bacteria we're dealing with, we can give like an ampicillin, which is a broad spectrum, just simply meaning it can uh, attack and it can work on many different kinds of bacteria. Okay, so therapeutic class is anti-infective, pharmacologic class, amino penicillin. And again, with these cillins, when you hear that cillin word, that cillin suffix, you're thinking penicillin. And the first thing that triggers off in your mind is you're thinking penicillin allergy. I need to assess for that. I need to watch for that. I need to make sure my patient has never had any sort of reaction to any sort of penicillin. So obviously, contraindicated in penicillin allergy, assess your patient, uh, check in the MAR if if there is any sort of uh, reaction, then you need to document that and make sure you let the patient know what happened and what they need to do. Even the slightest uh, reaction at any point in their life, they need to let people know, well, I had a slight reaction at some point to a cillin, okay? You need to use caution with renal insufficiency. These are excreted by the kidneys. They can uh, be damaging to kidneys. This also can cause seizures, diarrhea, anaphylaxis, and super infection. What's a super infection? What happens is we throw these broad spectrum antibiotics at people and the bacteria actually becomes stronger. It doesn't kill them off and can actually become stronger. That's a super infection. The way that we can notice that and what you want to teach your patient on how to identify that would be furry overgrowth on the tongue, vaginal itching, loose and foul smelling stool. So these can lead to like C. diff, okay? And if you've smelled C. diff, if you've ever been in a patient's room with C. diff, you will never forget that smell. And you can even just walk into a room and be like, well, we got to do a culture for C. diff, okay? We got to check for that. So the this can cause this diarrhea, it can cause this super infection, and you know we'll uh, we'll be able to recognize that. So we're going to assess our infection, make sure infection is getting better. If we're giving it for otitis media, we want to make sure the uh, ear infection is improving and that we're getting better, right? That's what our whole goal is here. One big thing with this too is you want to let the patient know that they should not use with oral contraceptives, okay? So contraindicated with oral contraceptive use, and we're going to monitor liver function tests as well. So kind of a very broad spectrum, as we said, it has a huge from skin infections to septicemia, meningitis, just a huge GU infections. It has a huge range of things that it can be given for. Penicillin allergy is a big thing we're going to watch out for, uh, and that is This has uh, been another episode of the Med Master Podcast, brought to you by medmastercourse.com and nrsng.com. My name is John Haas, RN, CCRN, student nurse mentor, and your biggest fan. If you're ready to demolish nursing pharmacology once and for all, head over to medmastercourse.com and use the coupon code PODCAST to save 15% on lifetime membership to MedMaster Course. MedMaster Course is packed full of 30 plus hours of HD video and audio content with tons and tons of free cheat sheets and downloads. Demolish nursing pharmacology. Never guess a med again. Go to medmastercourse.com. Coupon code podcast. You guys know what time it is now. Go out and do something great. Happy nursing. Happy nursing.